everybody, it's Jason here at Perkins Motorplex. Just grabbing you a quick video of that 2021 Mazda 6 Touring we spoke about earlier. Uh, I've walked around this car and checked it out. It's in really good shape, but I'll just kind of start at the front, work our way around so you can get a better look also. A uh, little dusty because we had just a little bit of rain here earlier. Uh, sprinkles kind of picked up the dust there, but no real damage up front. I saw a couple little dings on the lower valence. You know, these cars sit pretty low. Uh, there's a couple little touch-up spots down there. Uh, as you can see from a couple of feet back, really nothing to major to point out at all. Grill, hoods, really good shape. Again, no damage. Really nice and clean. Going down that driver's side, I saw, I think, one tiny beam. I'm not sure that it's showing the video. It's so small, but I'll try to point that out when I get there. Uh, no curb rash or damage on the front wheel. Tires still have great tread left on them. They're good to go. There was a tiny door ding right here. Uh, kind of wipe that dust away. Try to get some glare on it. There you go. I use that stripe for some glare. You can see the tiny door ding right there. But other than that, no damage really going down the driver's side. Uh, no major scratches, tinted windows. Uh, the roof rack, as we spoke about earlier, I'll stop real quick. Again, that fits in those factory channels. So there's no drilling, nothing weird there. Those will come right off if you want to take those off. Uh, no curb rash or damage on the back driver's side wheel. Again, tires are in good shape. Spinning around to the back of the vehicle. Again, no major issues back here to point out either. No major dings, dents, or scratches. Again, nice tinted windows. No damage on that rear bumper. And going down the passenger side, again, really clean. I didn't see any major issues to point out at all. Um, maybe a tiny ding right there. Again, that's small enough. I don't know if I can get it to, you can almost see it if I get a little glare there. Just tiny little door ding. But other than that, really clean, really nice. No curb rash or damage on either of those passenger side wheels. Again, tires are still in good shape. So really good with the car. I will point out it arrived with one key. Uh, one key five, remote of course. Uh, and this one has, of course, rear trunk release lock and lock push to start on this vehicle and it's really clean inside as you probably saw in those original uh, pictures online it's got a like mats all the way through this vehicle so like a really fancy floor mats that go in this vehicle uh, no damage inside minimal wear on the driver's seat Jump in here and start it up so you can take a look So it has 64,074 miles as it sits here now. Um, it's been serviced, ready to go. So all the service has been done, oil change. Everything is nice and clean. Again, no damage, no weird smells or odors, no smoke smell. Sunroof, oh, I did notice one little tear or something up here. Get back so that'll zoom in. One little one little spot there. Almost feels like a burn hole to be honest, but there's no smoke smell in here, which is odd. But I uh, did want to point that out. Jump to the back here. We can have our guy touch that up, by the way. Guy comes here and does that. Nice and clean in the back again. Fancy floor mats. No damage on that back seat. So really that little spot there, as you can see up there on the front, right above the driver's side, uh, little spot on the uh, headliner there is the only thing worth pointing out on the inside. Now this vehicle has, like I mentioned, has been serviced and inspected, comes with our 30 day warranty. And because of that, you actually have the availability of up to a, on that year model, you could do up to a six year, 120,000 mile factory coverage on this car as well. That's a big deal because it would pick up engine, transmission, drivetrain, but it also would go back and pick up the comprehensive coverage. So the things such as that touchscreen, nav, the computers, you know, the lane departure systems. This one has the laser cruise control on it as well. It would pick up all of those tech items, all of the camera systems. It would take all of that coverage to the 120,000 mile mark. Uh, so you'll have that availability as well. I'll go over that when we get to that point. But again, beautiful car. You're going to love it.